I went to South Africa to learn about how African penguins are doing in the wild. And what I found out actually really surprised me. So in 2012, we almost had no international volunteers. So we had a few in the program, they left by middle December, and we had chicks everywhere. We had a really high chick season. And at that point, we had two zookeepers helping us. So it was me and two zookeepers on a day, and that's it. There's no one else in the center. So we came in really, really early. I think I was here just after five in the morning. They joined me about six. And we literally just ran from pen to pen. Tube, you know, you finish tubing, you jump onto the next pen. Then you run up into general, quickly make some formula, make some darrows, run back down again. And we did that probably until eight, nine o'clock that night. And then we started the paperwork. So then they go home and I started the cards. The day when they get to leave here, so, you know, when we put those, those cardboard boxes in the vehicle and you know, all the volunteers are loaded in the vehicle with them and they head off to be released or when we can stand on the beach and we watch them walk into the ocean. It really is a powerful feeling. I don't know, if you if you don't do it, you're not going to understand it. You, you, there's people that think you're absolutely crazy for doing work like this, but until you've actually worked with the birds and you've seen what some of them look like when they come in and yeah, like I say, the fact you're able to help them it's yeah, you know, it's it's a good feeling, and, and no one does this for the money. <laughs> you do this, you do this for the love, and yeah, you know, the the commitment to these birds. Is, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was very surprised to learn that there is just a lot of problems that there are not yet answers to. Less than two percent of the population of African penguins remains in the wild. Maybe you can't just pack up and go to Africa. But there are a lot easier things to do, like learning about them. Go to the website, consider adopting a penguin, tell your friends, get the word out there. African penguins are not doing super great right now, and they need our help.